Hi everyone, my name is Calvin Ma. I'm a ceramic sculptor based in San Francisco. Um, my work is mainly sculptural, but I really enjoy making cups also. So for the next few weeks, I'm gonna be showing you guys a step-by-step -step process of how I make my bird cups. Um, they're gonna look a little something like this, uh, but it's gonna be a lot more colorful. There's gonna be a bird handle, and I'm gonna be working on a three ounce version and an eight ounce version as well. And at the end of it, when it's all complete, I'm gonna be submitting those two cups into the Ensika Virtual Exhibition and Cup Sale. And you guys are welcome to enter too, because I believe that submissions are open right now. And I think the exhibition is gonna open in early September. Um, but before we get into it all, I'm gonna give you guys a quick studio tour just to let you see where I get my work done. Let's do it. This is my work desk right here. This is my wife, Erica Sonata's desk. She's a ceramic artist as well. And this is our third studio mate. Say hi, Rocket. We got some big kilns, a spray booth in the corner. And the studio looks like a mess right now because we've been rearranging a lot of stuff lately. Um, we got a rest area. And then we got my mold collection here. Lots of molds, and then a lot of packing material. Got foam, boxes, more boxes, small kitchenette, and that's the studio. Okay, so here we have everything we need to make the bird cups. Uh, I sculpted the original, made molds of everything, so here we have the 8 ounce cup, the 3 ounce cup, and two different sized birds that are going to act as the handles for each one. And the 3 ounce cup mold is a little past its prime. The details are a little worn out, but we're going to try to squeeze one more cast out of it and see how that goes. Um, usually when I spend a chunk of time sculpting something, I like to make a mold out of it just to lock in that design so I have access to that pattern later on. That's the little birdie right there. Okay, and to cast, we're going to use Laguna B-Mix Cone 5 casting slip. So we're just going to let that sit for about an hour to an hour and a half. So it's been about an hour, so I'm going to empty the bird mold here. Okay. And for this one, it's small enough that I don't have to pour out any excess. I'm just going to let these two sit overnight and pull them out tomorrow. Okay, so it's been about an hour and 20 minutes, so I'm gonna empty the three ounce bird cup right here. flip this upside down and let that sit overnight so it's been about an hour and 40 minutes and I let this one sit a bit longer because I wanted that wall thickness to be a little thicker since it's a larger cup um, so we're gonna go ahead and empty it now pour out that excess Flip it upside down. And that's gonna sit overnight and I'll pop these out tomorrow. 